Black Friday is just a week away, and this morning there's a new warning for anyone looking for a deal. A lot of those apps promising to save you big bucks, well, they may be fake, costing consumers billions. Our chief business correspondent, Rebecca Jarvis, is here with the details here. I knew it was too good to be true. It, <laughs> if it sounds too yeah, good to be true, it's always too good to be true. Good morning, Robin. Good morning, guys. Yes, we all know the dangers of Black Friday in stores, those huge crowds, stampedes, chaos. But lately, so many of us are turning online. Last year, we spent more than $12 billion over the Black Friday weekend online. And this year, consumer site Risk IQ is warning that anyone hunting for those mega deals on mobile has to watch out for malicious and fraudulent apps. They've now identified 32,000 fake mobile apps that will use the names of well-known retailers to trick users into entering their personal credit card information, Facebook and Gmail logins, downloading malware that can potentially steal your information. And then, Robin, we've heard about this one, too. It can even lock your phone so that you have to pay a ransom just to get back access to it. So what do we do? to protect ourselves. All right, so there are some really important things. First of all, stick to the apps in the app stores. The mm -hmm. Google Play App Store, the Apple App Store, one way these fake apps are spreading is on social media. So you have to be really careful what you click on Facebook, on Twitter, on Instagram. Also be wary of any app that asks for access to things like your contacts, like your stored passwords yeah. or your credit card information. And lastly, check for grammar errors. It sounds so simple, but a lot of the fake apps have misspellings and they're filled with with grammar errors, so it's a dead giveaway. They're not the real deal. That's a good little trick there. Yeah. All right, so I know it's not until next Friday, but there's still some deals coming out every day. Everybody you wants to, to get out there early. They say the early bird gets the worm. So a lot of the deals right now are on TVs. Best Buy has a TV right now, $300 off there. Costco has more than 20 TVs right now. Deep discounts there. But here's the important thing to keep in mind. In general, historically, all the best deals on electronics and TVs come on the real Black Friday, so it can be it can be worth your time to but it's wait. It's so tempting. It is so tempting. You can save the receipt. So if you buy it now, save the receipt. Check the deals later. I love this kid. You know, I like my deals. I like my deals. <laughs> Thank you, Rebecca.